Hey everybody, thanks for checking out Foraging for Balance. It's kind of my channel about everything about life um, and all the stuff I do. I always don't post things, I don't work on it. I'm always like, oh, I want to be so perfect, right? I look at other YouTubers and the background, their house is like all pristine and beautiful and clean and I'm like, shit, my house does not look like that. Um, also, they have like cute little intro videos and music and I don't, I don't know how to figure that out. I'm not there yet. Uh, but I talked to a friend yesterday and she's fantastic. And you know, sometimes in life you just need to jump in and do things. Just go for it. You can figure out the details later. So, uh, part of our conversation yesterday was I, was about the background, like, the stuff going on behind you in your videos, right? And I was like, I really love Emmy Made in Japan. Everything is so cute and beautiful behind her. And she's like, look, Jackie, it doesn't matter. Your house is messy. It doesn't matter. Um, because you can show that. I know my hand just keeps coming in front of my face. You can show that and... Some people are gonna look down on you, and that's their deal. Some people are just gonna feel really good about themselves, so they're like, ha, my house is so much better than that. And some people are gonna go, hey, her house looks like mine. I guess I'm not doing so bad. So, uh, this is kind of just a little intro to make myself do it. I'm just gonna do it. So this room that we're in is actually pretty nice looking. This is like my yoga quiet practice room but you'll know like over in this corner so there's all my burlesque stuff i'm actually i'm gonna flip the camera around we'll take a, a mini tour of the disaster that is my home and it's mine and you know that's it or maybe i'm not gonna flip the camera around because it doesn't want to do it while i'm recording Nope. I guess I'll just be in the video. So, on my wall, it's going to be like backwards, right? There's a Dr. Seuss quote. It says, unless someone like you cares a whole awful lot, nothing is going to get better. It's not. And it's from the book, The Lorax. I love Dr. Seuss. It's amazing. Um, so, traveling down this darkened hallway, come to this bedroom. This we've deemed... It should be like the spare bedroom. Um, it's my husband's plant stuff. Yeah. Okay, it smells a little weird in there. But it's just plant moisture. All right, pop across the hallway. All right, it's really dark in here. This, this disaster is my daughter's room. She says she likes it like that. And I'm not about to clean it for her. Okay, this bathroom, well, relatively, you know, it's it's normal bathroom-ish. There's, it's pretty clean, actually. This, however, stacks of boxes. If anybody needs boxes, um, actually, thankfully, a bunch of those are imperfect produce boxes, and they can take those back now, starting this week. So next week I'll have to remember to, um, I already had my delivery this week, so next week I'll have to put out the boxes. But Imperfect Produce, keep going. Do, do, do. This is like, okay, this is the dining room table that we never eat at. You'll see back there my very high-tech ramen noodles. Um, that's because I'm supposed to eat a crap ton of sodium. I know, that sounds weird, right? Look up POTS, Postural Orthostatic Tachycardia Syndrome, if you want to know why. Uh, and then the land of rhinestones and pasties for my burlesquing life. Uh, and this is just a bunch of random stuff on top of this uh, entertainment center. That's mostly my husband's stuff. And into our kitchen. Oh, sorry, got a little... My nose itches. 
so we have this bookcase. There's cookbooks at the bottom and various and all kinds of stuff on it. And the guinea pig. You probably shouldn't walk around in here naked. Um, I'm making a video. I'm YouTubing. I'm YouTubing it. My daughter's dream in life is to be a YouTube star. So, you know, kitchen, refrigerator full of children's artwork. I just have stuff on my counters. Most of it's food. Popcorn. Chex Mix. I think I could live off Chex Mix. It's pretty fantastic. Stocking. It's August. It's just been there. Doo, doo, doo. Two more rooms. Uh, so this is our living room that we use. <laughs> And you'll see it's mostly taken over by my child's stuff. And the TV. And yes, that's an original Nintendo Entertainment System with some black raspberry pie dribble on it, courtesy of my daughter. Oh, she keeps trying to show me something on her finger. I think it's a booger. And then this is the bedroom. Lots of clothes everywhere. So yeah, that's my video of, you know, mediocrity. And I'm learning to be okay with it, you know? Um, I only have so much time in a day. I only have so much energy in a day. And cleaning, it's not so much the cleaning, it's the keeping everything organized. Um, it's just not a top priority. <laughs> I have a business to run. I have multiple like small side jobs. I have the burlesque thing that I started. And so if this is the price to pay to have jobs that I really enjoy, mm, I'll get over it. All right, so let me know in the comments, what does your house look like? <laughs> is it spotless? Is it kind of like mine? Do you belong on an episode of Hoarders? All right, thanks. And hopefully I'll see you back on my channel sometime. Bye.